So my name is Erin and the goal of today's Minute Clinic is to give you a better understanding on how to have a successful discovery. Um, our last Minute Clinic talked about our upfront contracts and how those could help you be successful. This will dig into a little bit more of um, the center of your conversation and how we really get to the goal, which is to find um, the driving event and how we next sell the conversation to the account executive. So main idea behind the discovery is to focus on three main uh, points or three main ideas. First one is to um, pick the lane that you're going to go with, uh, steer the conversation, and then find the driving event. Again, finding the driving event and selling the conversation to give the account executive an at-bat is the whole goal of discovery. Um, well, how do you know where the conversation is going to go? And you primarily start with um, the question, what brought you to Salesforce? And you know what they've looked at by checking the campaign history. You know um, pretty high level what their company does by checking their website. but why they're coming over to you is, is for you to figure out. You do that through finding whether or not it is um, a pain conversation or a gain conversation. Um, you can do that by kind of noticing um, a couple different things. Primarily a pain conversation will have uh, issues like their existing system isn't working or they have low user adoption, their sales are low, they can't scale with their current system, they're not hitting their goals. Those are all opportunities um, for you to ask deeper questions. Additionally, a gain side would be, you know, we consistently see gain conversations happen with new businesses or businesses that are growing quickly. Um, they're expanding to new markets, they're hiring on new people, uh, their headcounts growing, whatever it may be. Um, additionally, maybe they just um, sat down with, with their company and, and they've developed a lot of new goals and they're not really sure how they're going to reach them. Well, um, kind of moving from there, once you figure out, you know, which side you're going to go with, it's really important to, um, to stop, listen, and then ask strategic questions. So ideally your conversation should look something like this, where you give your upfront contract, you identify whether or not it's, or whether it's gonna be a pain or a gain conversation, and it actually sometimes may be both, um, so definitely don't limit yourself to one of the two. Um, but the goal really is to find out, you know, maybe they give you four or five pain points or four or five gain points, Figure out which of those are, are hitting home the most and which are um, affecting the business financially or um, maybe they're unable to grow, whatever it may be, and, and dig a little bit deeper on those. So really this is just an example of um, how you're listening, talking less, and then getting down to hopefully L2 and L3. Um, but how do you get there? Well, you should ask strategic questions. And your questions really ideally should be layered. Uh, they should be open-ended and they should also be focused and by focus I mean where are you uh, looking to lead the conversation what are those main pain or gain points um, some great examples of of layering and keeping them open-ended as well as being focused for the gain side you can always ask uh, what are you doing today um, give me a little bit of insight into that uh, additionally how long has that been a problem and what have you done to, to try to fix it uh, equally on the gain side, you can also ask, what are you doing today? Where do you want to be in, in 6 to 12 months? And then initially, how we measure success. Kind of walking through those questions, you're going to get a better idea of, again, that main driving point on why the conversation with the account executive is going to be really important. And then also tee up that to give them the best at-bat to better find a solution for their business. Kind of moving forward from there, then, you'll have your recap and close, which is, I believe, our next.